I am Cody Sandall, and in honor of Halloween, let me tell you a terrifying story. When I was in elementary school, my family came home late one night, very late, and so everyone stumbled out of the car after my parents pulled into the garage and shut the garage door and found their way to bed as quickly as possible. Everyone that is but me. I had fallen asleep in the back of the car, and so eventually I woke up in the middle of the night. No one noticed that I had not followed the rest of the family. I woke up in the middle of the night and was bathed in complete darkness around me. I stumbled around, fumbled my way, trying to find the door. I eventually found the door only to discover the door was locked. I couldn't get inside. As my fear level started to, to creep up, I, I banged on the door as hard as I could. I shouted at the top of my lungs, I'm in the garage, I'm in the garage. But the garage is very far away from the bedrooms in that house, and no one could hear me. Now, of course, eventually my parents did hear me, and my mom was probably mortified that I'm telling this story in a video. But I was reminded of this story as I read our text this week, because in it, the Israelites are afraid that God is going to leave them alone in the dark. They're afraid that no matter how hard they bang on God's door or shout at God, that he won't hear them. Have you ever felt that way, like you're, you're banging on the door in the dark, shouting for God's attention, but you don't get anything back? Well, if you want to know God's response, we hope to see you on Sunday at 8.30 or 10.30 a.m. Have a good week.